Welcome back. Today I'm doing a one brand video, this time with Dior. Can you believe I'm working with Dior? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Today I'm going to do a natural, beautiful, glowing makeup look using a bunch of their products but focusing on a big, beautiful, glowing, juicy lip. So I'm going to do a natural look and then end with that and I hope you guys like. Let's start. So we are going to actually start very glamorously by putting something over your hairline because the product that I'm going to use is one of my favorite foundations ever. It's awesome. It is the Air Flash foundation from Dior. It is just the most like airbrush look ever. I'm so happy that I have more again. This is what it looks like. It comes in a can like this. You have to shake it up really well. I'm using the color 300 and what I'm going to do is spritz it over my forehead and, oh, an eyelash, and my cheeks and my chin. So, like that, like that. Just watch your earrings. It's just a little kabuki brush. I prefer to use kabuki brushes. Some people like to spray the product directly onto the brush, but I prefer to put it onto my face. It's really quick to apply, like it's definitely the quickest applying foundation evs. Now you can take off this stylish thing. As you can see, it's like the foundation got on the edge there, so you really should put something over your hairline if you're going to spray it directly to your face. Fix up your hair so you don't look like a freak. I'm going to do my brows super quick. Just brush them up. This is the Lancome Brow Pencil. Whenever I do my brows, I like can't talk at the same time because my brain just stops working. It's focusing too hard. Keep it natural. I just take my foundation brush over the top and I do that every time I do my brows. Now I got this amazing palette. I revive a palette in 002. Going to start by applying the base color all over my eyelid. This way, all the other shadows are going to blend out super duper easily. I'm going to take the pink, put it over the lid, I'm going to take this brown, same brush, I just dusted it off, mix it with the darker brown, and I'm going to pop that on the outer third. Now if I want to conceal under my eyes, I just take foundation brush and a lighter shade of foundation, or you could use the same one anyways, but I'm going to spritz some just onto the end of the brush and use that to clean up any fallout. There isn't much, but just use it to brighten the area anyway. Take Dior Show Mascara, absolute classic. For blush, you can use this amazing product. It's the Rosy Glow in 001 Petal. Can we talk about this? It's not even picking up how bright it is. It is like the most beautiful neon pink. I just adore. And um, I'm going to pick some up, put it on the cheeks. Yes. I don't think I'm weird, but there's a bit going up here. Just for a flush. And then this. This is one of my faves for the face. Let me reveal. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Look at that. So reflective. So reflective. Okay, now we're going to apply this. We're all going to appreciate the glow. Flick it up under the brow. Oh, I love this guy. I've also got this glow maximizer it's a primer but it can it's like a liquid illuminator too I'm gonna dab some here and here I love putting highlighter in there pop some in here at the inner corner so the complexion is done I really love it so far but of course we need to do our lips 
And for our lips, I'm going to start with my Dior Contour Color Reviver and Filler Lip Glow Liner. So the Lip Glow range, it's a range of the products that react with your natural chemistry in your lips and then create like a custom color. So when I apply this, it creates like a custom Chloe Morello lip color. But this lip, this is a lip liner, like you can use it with any lip product and it will prevent bleeding and it will also boost the natural color of your lips under whatever lipstick you're wearing. It's really hydrating as well. It's like a good base. And it's got collagen active technology to smooth out my lips in preparation for Dior Lip Glow. Now I'm just going to show you because I recently got some other colors as well. Um, here in Australia I got sent the new 005 Lilac which is obviously a really pretty lilac shade. So it would have like a lilac glow to it once it reacts to your lips. And then also coral, which I wore the other day. It's beautiful, I got compliments on that. But then there's 001, which is the normal one, or the original, and it's just this glowing pink. And I'm gonna apply it to half my lips so you, maybe you can see the difference. I don't know if you can see that this side's just a bit more pale and then this side it's really brought out that natural pink so it's like the most flattering pink or most flattering natural lip color. I love this lipstick. It's like, or this balm. It's so hydrating and soft and buttery and keeps my lips so hydrated for hours and hours and hours and hours. And the color also stays on my lips after the balm wears off, which is interesting. So you can wear this under a sheer gloss, which I'm going to do as well, Lip Maximizer. This is the best selling lip plumping gloss on the market for prestige products. And it's definitely one of my favorites. I mean, this one I've had for a while. They did send me a backup. Yes. And they also have other shades. I bought this one in London last year. This is 006. It's a nude it's more nude and then this one is like the original me and my friend Nina we're addicted to big lips as you guys know and we're addicted to the lip maximizer I love this because it gives them a really wet glossy look that's what I love about it but it also has hyaluronic spheres and the peppermint in it which instantly boosts the volume of the lips like my lips already look way bigger I love it so juicy <laughs> if you want you can also use this as a primer before you apply other lip products because it makes your lips bigger underneath and then it will boost the look after you apply the other lip products so that is my finished look <sighs> okay stop staring at yourself I'm turning the viewfinder around <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial and let me know which one brand video you would like to see next bye before I go, there's one final thank you for watching and of course a huge thank you to Dior. There are some special links in the description so go check those out. Bye!